want to talk about multicultural family. Um, you know now, the international marriage is really common. Um, like me, for example, like me, I am Chinese, but I'm married to the Malaysian. So though I am, though my husband is Chinese Malaysian, but still. Um, I think I could consider this as the international marriage. So, if you have an international marriage, then there comes a questions about your kids. So, it's easy if both of parents are from same country. Like if, um, for like if my husband is Chinese and I'm a Chinese too. Then definitely, you and I and Jimmy, I would consider them as the Chinese American. But in our situation, my husband is Malaysian actually, though he's Chinese Malaysian. And for me, I am a Chinese, but I will consider myself as Korean Chinese. No idea what Yuna and Jimmy is, cause um. In America, there is a lot of different cultures or a lot of different nationalities. So when you fill out some forms, they always ask, "Are you Chinese? Are you Korean? Japanese? Or maybe Asian, Hispanic?" So last time when I fill out the one form for Yuna, it asked your it asked for you to choose one of them. So I actually choose Chinese. Um, I have no question about it because first, Yuna speak Chinese. Yuna speak Chinese, and um, we we are eating a lot of Chinese food. <laughs> and um, but also, I I teach Yuna some Koreans, and then we are eating Korean food, and then we have lots of friends. Who's speaking Korean? So you and your spouse has different、um, nationalities. So in your case, if you are like me, has a international marriage, then how you define your kids? Who are they?、Um, the comment and let me know how you think. And that's all for today. Thank you for watching.